Damn, after this snatch, my pinky toe got destroyed, and I can't walk properly for a week, man. So please, don't do this at home. Okay, have you ever wondered how does it feel to play in the dunks? I mean, people in the 80s, they did it. Well, technically, they played in the Jordan 1s, but I feel like it's the same thing. And I just happen to have this Jordan 1 Travis Scott in hand. Why don't we try it out? No way, what are you insane? I mean, I will not play in the high tops. Let's try the lows instead. How about the Fragment Jordan 1 lows? <laughs> nah, I'm trying to play ball here, not with my kidney, all right? Let's just start with a pair of dunks for now. First off, sizing. The dunk fits shoe to size. Just stick to your normal size or whatever the casual shoe size you're wearing, and you're good to go. Next, cushion. I don't know if you know this or not, but the dunks have no cushion whatsoever. Some special dunks, maybe they do, but not the regular dunks. So every time you land, you land on this very dense rubber missile, and it blows. I only played for 30 minutes, every joint in my body was screaming, and I probably had a mild concussion as well. However, the court feel is amazing, almost feel like you're not wearing any shoes. For the support, it's actually pretty solid. If you tie the shoes pretty well, the leather side panel will close up and hug your feet, so you have a lockdown containment. And forget about the fancy lacing system, the asymmetrical, the dynamic loops, the old fashioned lacing on the dunks just work. You play all you want, the lace will not move a bit. Plus, the shoe has a very low center of gravity to give you that stable feel. I'm actually impressed with the overall support on the dunks. Lastly, traction. The dunks have the same grip pattern as the Jordan 1s. I should say the bottoms look exactly the same. Made with solid rubber, the traction is probably the highlight of the shoe. You will stop on a dime every single time and you don't even need to wipe. I was amazed by how good the stopping power is, other than my crushed pinky toe. So overall, the dunks are very decent basketball shoes if we just forget about cushion for a minute. Can you play in the dunks? Of course, but it depends. Casually, sure, go ahead, but do not do anything above. And remember, don't jump too much. Your body will thank you for that. So, have you ever played in the dunks? Let me know your experience in the comments.